Welcome to one of the easiest and most interesting topics of the year. I like it a lot. It's a good way to start the year because it puts students, it gets students excited about uh, biology. And this is actually looking at biology from really far away. It's looking at the interactions that exist between all living things and their environment. We're talking about ecology. Like I just said, ecology is the study of how all the living things interact with each other and with their, the non-living parts of their environment. So it's the study of ecosystems. And it's very interesting because it's all about, you know, interactions, complexity, exchanges of matter and energy. It's about communication. And it's about applying basic concepts of biology at the macroscopic level, at the level of the world, basically. And we're going to learn about lots of things. We're going to learn about how to produce and consume energy. We're going to talk about how animals interact with each other in communities. We're going to be talking about ecosystems, the types of biomes that exist around the world. We're, we're going to talk about you know energy being transferred across the food web and food, food chains, food pyramids. We're going to talk about biochemical cycles and how the matter is transferred also throughout nature. We're going to talk about eco environmental science, which is a special branch of ecology that talks about how humans interact with the environment and how the environment also affects humans. We're going to talk about how ecosystems start and how they develop and how they recover from disturbances. It will also talk about population ecology, which is how populations grow, the factors which determine whether they can uh, get larger or smaller over time, and why some populations thrive and others don't, uh, strategies for survival that different animals will, uh, will have. All of these are very interesting things. We'll also talk about human population growth, patterns of, of human growth, and what we're doing to the world, and, and concepts of like how much the world can take, basically. A lot of stuff. So there it comes, ecology, better be ready for it, the study of living things, interactions with each other, and with the non-living parts of their environments. Hope you have fun.